Hello, my dear friends, and welcome to my channel. If you are watching this video, you want to get an honest review of PDF Element by Wondershare. When you need to deal with a lot of PDF documents, either for work or your studies or for researchers, it's a trouble, but PDF Element makes it easy because AI Engine will make your workflow easier and smarter. You can uh, edit the documents, you can uh, analyze them, you can translate it, so on and so forth. A lot of features that I will cover in this video and walk you through the process of uh, using all the AI features that are available in PDF Element. Check out the description box for the link to check out the PDF Element right away and click the subscribe button if you still didn't do it let's go let's have an overview on what features a PDF element has so it has AI tools which I will cover in this video so you can chat with multiple PDF and summarize them simultaneously with AI you can uh, check the grammar you can have the translator you can have some AI prompts to give more options when working and learning except for AI you can edit your document you can confer convert to different formats OCR so you can recognize text from scanned PDF and images you can have an a, a, a an e-signature you can create pdfs from any file you can organize them to read you can uh, have different forms and of course you can protect it by different things by passwords for example or uh, by other means uh, yes it's secure compliant and professional let's switch to the application itself what I'm going to do right now is open a PDF that I already have. I'm opening it up. It's an article about what's in a name an analysis of vegan and plant based labels. That's a report for 11 or um, 13 pages. It's pretty middle like average in the size so chat with pdf chat with ai so what i can do i can first of all um, ask some questions. Uh, for example, summarize plant-based uh, versus vegan report and what is the main argument of the PDF. Let's summarize it. And it takes a little bit of time to wait. I do have the result. The report by the Vegan Society explores the implications of the terms vegan and plant-based in the context of food labeling and consumer perception, so on and so forth. The report concludes that while plant-based may appeal to a broader audience, it lacks the clarity and ethical commitment associated with veganism necessi necessitating further research to understand its impact on the vegan movement. You can have additional uh, questions to ask your PDF document and uh, that's pretty easy. And when you chat with the AI, you can have some additional things to ask uh except for the pdf that you have we are moving on and uh i suggest to check some other things uh that are available right here so we already did a summary of the text but of course you can ask ask some other questions let's let's check out the translate the uh word translator pdf translator a uh, target language let's choose german and translate let's do it and right now we can compare both documents. Uh, let's see again what's inside, what's in a name and analysis of vegan and plant based labels. Uh, in German, was steht im Namen Analyse der veganen und pflanzlichen Etiketten? Here is Anleitung der Pflanzen und Spruch der modernen Definition, so on and so forth. And here we also have this thing. Uh, let's check some German version as well. What text is here? What do we have? So on and so forth. Um, yes, a German language needs a little bit more words than English one. So that's why in some cases there might be some different fonts of different sizes just to um, just to keep the original uh, layout. And we are checking uh, some more things, uh, for example, AI grammar check, paragraph grammar check. I'm choosing this paragraph and it's being analyzed. These should be changed, these should be changed uh, to D for the consistency income. A comma should be added before which 
uh, in the Senate, starting with the Vegan Society has produced these initial reports. So what's the purpose of this? To make your document look um, professional and uh, that you, for example, at work or in your education process, you have everything written right and you will have no mistakes. One more thing that is very cool here, it's AI written check. You can detect if the document was written by AI or by human, important for some researchers or uh, some professional reports that you are making and Yes, there is a variety of uses. The detection has been complete. Your file is written by humans. So the sentence highlighted by uh, the yellow are more likely to be written by AI. But the name is what is in a name. I actually don't think that it was written by AI. Maybe uh, this system just detected it to be written by AI, but you never know. It's better to make sure uh, whatever is under suspicions, you can uh, check it, recheck it, and have your conclusions. Very beautiful uh, platform, uh, PDF element. I suggest you to try it out. The link is below here, below the video. Uh, download it and try it for free. I wish you a good day and very successful work or your education and any other things that you are engaged with. Have a good day. Bye-bye.